everybody, how's it going? I hope you're all doing really well. So for this week, the book is A Radical Acceptance. And I came across this term. Into changing does not work. And every single time I have done that, I've always fallen flat in my face. And so I came across this book and I was like, okay, interesting. What does she, what does the, she, what does she mean by radical acceptance? And some of those things, so these are three of the lessons that I learned and yeah. So number one, you cannot hate yourself into changing. You cannot say, hey, I hate ABCD about myself, so I'm going to change it. Because lasting change happens through love, you know? And when I say radical acceptance, I don't mean that you need to give yourself, that you need to not be accountable. You can say, you know what? I, I hold myself accountable and I'm gonna love myself through this process as I work towards something that I really want to work on. So it's really taught me not to look at life in terms of, oh, I hate this about myself, so I'm going to change it. Whereas radical acceptance is, you know what? Yes, I have this particular issue that I need to that I need to work on, but I'm going to hug myself through it, and I'm not going to ridicule myself or hate myself. You don't need to do anything in order for you to be worthy. Nothing. The fact that you are here and that you're motivated to work on yourself, that's it. You motivated to work on yourself, to grow, to unlearn, and that is so important. So yes, and the reason you are here is because, and the reason that I'm here as well, is because we are going to be learning and we are going to apply radical acceptance into our lives. We're gonna invite it and we're going to work on the healing process and the growing and you can still grow and love yourself at the same time. That is a word. <laughs> yes, you can, still, you can still say you can love yourself and still make changes in your life. And so these changes don't have to come from a place of hate and that that inner the love that we have for ourselves don't separate change from love 